So I'm over at Neil's, and, and this is uh, part of the uh, part of the captain's chair. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. This is Command Central. Now, I don't know if you can see that, but he's uh, working on some editing right there for some stuff that we can't tell you too much about. And over here, I was mucking around. I brought some CDs over, and one of the tunes that I brought over was a song by Dido that I really, really like. And I was just trying to muck around with trying to figure out how to do it, and then I said, you know what, I've got... Boy Wonder next to me, and so he played the CD, and I'm just going to play a little tiny bit of it for you. Take it back to the beginning. Yeah, just so you get to yeah. hear. Oh, wrong song. I think that's right. Now it is. It'll take a second for the CD to kick in. Again. Yeah, so just listen to this, guys. What I'm hearing there's a chord progression. It's D. G, basically. But this little, but we've got this little moving thing. Um, on the D chord, we're hearing this. We're hearing a D. We're hearing a pair of notes. I'm making it way more complicated. Yeah, no, I was going to say that. There, there's a word for that you used before. It's a, like a sting type of acoustic. What do you call it? Uh, you pinch it. You've got a technique there that you're kind of using. Um, um, well, it's, it's, it's kind of a hybrid finger picking strumming thing. Right. But, uh, um, and we've used, we, yeah, we used the term claw hammer a little bit for Neil Young stuff. That's, that's not exactly this. Um, but what. Um, but what, what's going on on that guitar is it's actually really easy. It's not because they're in an open tuning. And, and the, what I got, I got to figure out what's going on in the tuning. It could just be drop D, a high drop D. Because right. I'm hearing the, the high. Now, are you sure? So I want to ask you this because this is why we, I grabbed the flip. Just Because, okay. you know, this isn't professional, guys. But uh -huh. I just figured it was a unique little opportunity to show you how Neil just deciphers songs because he literally is doing it right now. We didn't, we, we didn't practice for this. Um, why isn't it a capo, for instance? Because uh, what's happening is we're hearing, we're, I'm hearing an open note that you're, is a D. You're hearing that? Yeah, in, in both chords. Bloody hell, because I can't hear It's that. obvious. <laughs> There's, this note happens in both chords. Yeah, and, only, and, and it's, and it's both ringing chords. open, it's not, and it's not fretted. The, right. An open note and a fretted note have different sounds. Right. So, um, so I just went in, I just put, put an F sharp in the bass in the... But I don't think I'm, I want to do that. And why did you want an F sharp in the bass? Because I was thinking it might be an open D tuning, but it's actually sounding more like it could be open G. Um, but the notes I heard on the on the first chord were a slide, were, were an F sharp and an E, and then up to an F sharp, uh, then a higher, uh, I mean, an F sharp, a low F sharp and a high E. I see you hear that in the melody. Then we hear this, and the bass is changing. So. Um, Way it kind of worked out. We can just silence that for now. Although this is Less the pizza order. Important. It is. She just wants to know what kind it's of the pizza. pizza. Was. So guys, we're, we're ordering pizza. We're ordering no, pizza. we're actually going to put this on phone. We... Pizza we... points for us. We're shooting <laughs> a quick video. What's up? You're on it now. <laughs> Start the oven. You got the pizza. Okay. After the pizza call. Not what, spam, what we heard was a guys. Slide. Right. And yeah, on that note's not changing. So one note's changing and one's not. So that's what I hear in the melody. Then I hear the, two, this with, with chords changing. Um, if we had a D in the bass. I also don't normally play guitar in this chair because it's really uncomfortable. I, I, play, I sit in that chair when I'm, when I'm here in the office. <laughs> okay. Well, let's keep the same background. Let's play musical, musical rooms here. There we go. <laughs> it's live. <laughs> live, baby, live. Okay. All right. about that note yet. 
So we're gonna play a little bit more. This is what he does. Like, there's no music or anything. Once you start singing, that's that that's probably the chord change there. There's another section coming. Yeah, we're gonna listen to this this is the chorus. Got the uh, where it would be an F sharp minor, tenth fret, I guess. 